the moment you've all been waiting for. The green truck is done. All right, so it's been a while since the green truck has been in a video, so I'll give you a little bit of background. This was my great grandpa's truck. Uh, it's a Chevy 49, it's 1949 five window. And it was running, but like not running great. Um, this was my parents' getaway vehicle from their wedding. And we just picked it up from the shop. Grant and I are gonna take it for a little spin. How does it feel, Grant? Old. <laughs> it is pretty old. Yeah, the steering wheel feels so nice. Okay, we may have picked the <laughs> worst road. Why are we on gravel right now, Grant? I'll, I'll turn around, sorry. All right. I must say, it is quite rattly and bouncy. Uh, not quite as loud as the red Ford was when we first got it. Does any, did anyone remember that? Uh, now we have an exhaust on it, it's much better. Um, it's no luxury vehicle, but honestly, the seat's pretty comfy. I like it. Grant barely fits in here. This is definitely made for smaller people. <laughs> but I like it. I could see us going on some dates in this. All right, well, on the way home from picking up the truck, we saw this for sale sign. Here we go. Oh, yo. <laughs> uh, here we go. 2011, 8360, not even 4,000 hours. That was pretty depth. Tempting. Oh, wow, you're right. Oh. What do you think, guys? Laura Farms tractor? This is um, probably a little more realistic first tractor than the brand new 8RX. I kind of like it. Was coming. I've just been putting it off for quite a while. This is the day that we have to say goodbye to the John Deere NRX 370. Single tier. It's sad. She's been with us, oh, let's see here, since the very end of September. And it's what, mid November now? So I feel like she's a part of our family now. She's been so good to us. But the time has come. Acres needs her back. Here we go. I'm wearing my nice Acres coat here. So I'm making the slow drive. Well, 19 miles an hour. So not slow, but you know, compared to like 50. Um, back into town, taking back roads, just reminiscing the last moments I have with her. I'm saying goodbye to the quad tracks the key that you don't have to hold you just turn it and it turns on saying goodbye to the radio that has car play I'm saying goodbye to the heated seats the cooling seats and massaging seats that's that's one of the harder parts saying goodbye to all its air vents saying goodbye to the cooler that's right here saying goodbye to the leather seats Saying goodbye to this beautiful transmission we have here. We have all of 37.7 hours on it. <sighs> this is a tough goodbye, you guys. So if you remember in September when we first got this, it was the 8RX, but it was connected to the um, Elmer's Hallmaster 1300. This is a huge grain cart. If you don't remember that, you must go back and go back and watch those videos. The grain cart, the whole setup was just like incredible. Um, and then since then we've hooked this up to a disc and a root slicer and it did incredible with both. Um, so I want to thank Acres uh, for this excellent jacket. 
<laughs> um, but also for getting this whole demo put together. It's kind of like an extended demo. Um, and it was really cool because we got to show it to you guys in a lot of different ways. Um, so yeah, if you guys are looking for equipment, Acros will hook you up. Someone thought I was an Acres employee. Oh yeah? They came up and they were like, excuse me, um, ma'am, could you direct me to the front desk? And I was like, no? <laughs> like, like, oh. Oh yeah. I don't work here. I don't work here. Oh man, I'm so sorry. You're just sitting in this nice tractor and I saw the Acres logo, I just assumed. Nope. We are at the dealership. We have to give it back now. Shed a tear. Shed a tear. Well, thanks, Acres. <laughs> it's been we, good to us. We enjoyed it. When the used ones come up, we'll buy one. Sounds good. What are we going to do next? Now we got the trailer hooked up. It's never a good sign when you got the trailer hooked up. I guess we'll just have to see what we get there. Uh oh. Grant just got the monies out. Another toy. So uh, we drove for a few hours after dropping off the tractor. So we dropped off a tractor at the dealership that was worth $591,000. And now we're going to spend mm, $1,000 on a new toy. Let's go check it out at least, I guess. And here we are, new toy. Grant, tell me about what we have here. Yamaha, baby. That's Grant's favorite, in case you didn't know that. Three-cylinder. A work of art. It's gonna look oh, great in the shop. Here. Now we just need some snow. Yeah, so send the snow our way. <laughs> 